hello and welcome back to my youtube channel now today's video we're actually going to be doing a wardrobe switch over from winter to spring now i know what you're thinking why have i not done it before now considering it's now may april was a funny month weather wise we had a lot of april showers it was cold i mean i think we even had frost a couple of nights and yeah it's very very windy as well and i just i get very cold anyway and i kind of just wanted to keep my jumpers and now we've reached may it's getting a little bit warmer um i think it's currently like 22 degrees as i film this today so i thought it was now time that i do my wardrobe switch over i must admit i never actually did my wardrobe switch over from summer to winter last year because i got seriously ill and i never really had the chance to get it done so i do have a mixture in my wardrobe of summer stuff and winter stuff so it needs majorly sorting out so yeah so i thought now was the time to get it done yeah so as you can see here these are my vacuum pack bags that i've got from underneath my bed and yeah they've still got jumpers in them so i do need to go through them and kind of see which ones i want which ones i don't want and i've brought myself some more vacuum pack bags some new ones because i accidentally ripped one of them somewhere um and they don't work anymore so i've got some new ones and my rail is currently got jumpers on them because like i said i never actually switched my wardrobe over so my rail has kind of been a little bit of a dumping ground which is not what i want i want it all in my wardrobe so yeah and then when we actually go into my wardrobe i've got my coats and then i've got some cardigans jumper uh jumper dresses then i've got some mix of summer dresses and then obviously trousers skirts all that sort of stuff and then just my bags but they'll be staying where they are there's no point moving them because they're all sorted anyway so and then this one's my shoes but that doesn't need sorting because that's all been done previously and then yeah then we've got a mixture of jeans tops cardigans jackets shorts over here and then we've just got loads of blazers coats all that sort of stuff so yeah those are the two main places that i need to sort out i do have my chest of drawers but i kind of sorted out my jewelry drawer anyway so that's already sorted out um I did my underwear drawer which is this one and then I've got some thin jumpers which I may potentially sort out as well so yeah so those are the main things that need to be sorted out. so yes yeah, so the plan is is that I just take everything out of my wardrobe and then put back what I want to keep out for the spring and summer and put away all the stuff for my autumn winter stuff. I do have a video that I have done previously where it gives you all the steps to basically declutter in your wardrobe so I'll link that if you want to go check that one out. Then yeah, let's get into the cleaning. <sighs> thought I would just do one wardrobe at a time because I feel like otherwise it might become a bit overwhelming and my whole entire bed will just be covered in clothes and then I won't know where to begin so I've started off with this wardrobe I'm going to keep my coats in there um I probably will have a sort out there with my coats but I'm going to keep them in there purely because I like them to hang I know they should really go away but because also they're wool I just like them to sit nicely and 
yeah so I kind of just want to keep them there and then yeah so we've just got a range of summer stuff winter stuff so yeah so I'm just gonna go through all of these I've also got um these which are like cedar wood so it helps with obviously moths so because I have a lot of wool and stuff these are perfect so I've got these hanging up both sides and then I've also got like little cubes around the wardrobes which you can't really see but yeah so just to kind of keep the pests out of your clothes so yeah so I'm going to sort out this wardrobe then put all these back in and then go and tackle this wardrobe so that's the plan. wardrobe and doesn't it look so much nicer all that nice gap so I've got all my skirts there my trousers and then my dresses and then just my coats doesn't it look so pretty yay but yeah the way I do it is I do it by categories so I normally do it by length as well so all my skirts go in length order my trousers go in length order and then my dresses go in sleeve order and then obviously my coat but you could do it as like color wise or you know it's completely up to you but that's the best way I do it so yeah now let's move on to this wardrobe <laughs> out this wardrobe it looks so much nicer so much nicer so yeah that is all now done so I just need to sort this little pile out and basically go through all this and sort this out and yeah so these all need to go into vacuum pack bags so they can be packed away for winter that is a pile that's going to go in the clothes bin and then these are things that I'm going to sell so yeah definitely feel a lot more clearer clearer energy which is good I mean look at all them hangers mad so yeah I will somehow try and get these in two bags but we will make it work and now we have all of my winter stuff is all now vacuum packed I need to just get the hoover and obviously suck out the air but yeah and then they'll go away and that is everything done it actually took a lot less time than I thought it would do but we're all done now I've got beautiful clear wardrobes I've now just got to sell some stuff and take some stuff to the clothes bin and yeah we are now all done so that's one less job that I need to do so yeah so now I just need to pretty much go through my wardrobe see what my missing gaps are and then purchase those and then make endless endless outfits so yeah so thank you for watching this video and if you haven't done your switch over then go do it and yeah I will see you in the next one